One of the top stable coins today is the USDC. The crypto asset has been in the news since the collapse of the Silicon Valley Bank. So with this, we welcome you to the Financial Market Examiner our YouTube channel where you learn about Forex, crypto and the stock market. In this video, we'll learn about the USD coin. No need to wait any further, so let's get right into it. USD coin known by its ticker USDC is a stable coin that is pegged to the US dollar on a 1 ratio 1 basis. Every unit of this cryptocurrency in circulation is backed up by $1 that is held in reserve. In a mix of cash and short-term U.S. Treasury bonds, the Center Consortium has two founding members. One of them is the peer-to-peer -peer payment services company Circle, while the other is the Coinbase Cryptocurrency Exchange. Other crypto ventures are open to joining this consortium. So the Center Consortium, which is behind this asset, says USDC is issued by regulated financial institutions. The stablecoin originally launched on a limited basis in September 2018. Put simply, USD coin mantra is digital money for the digital age. And the stablecoin is designed for a world where cashless transactions are becoming common. Several use cases have been unveiled by the USD coin, as well as providing a safe haven for crypto traders in terms of volatility. And those behind the stablecoin say it can also allow businesses to accept payment in digital assets and shake up an array of sectors including decentralized finance and gaming. Overall, the goal is to create an ecosystem where USDC is accepted by many wallets, exchanges, service providers and dApps as possible. What makes USD coin unique? The stablecoin market has become exceedingly crowded over recent years, but USD coin has aimed to stand head and shoulders over competitors in several ways. One of them concerns transparency and giving users the assurance that they will be able to withdraw one USDC and receive one dollar in return without any issues. So to this end, it says a major accounting firm is tasked with verifying the levels of cash that are held and reserved, and ensuring this matches up with the number of tokens in circulation. Unlike some crypto ventures, Circle and Coinbase have also achieved regulatory compliance and this has helped pave the way for international expansion. Both projects are also well funded, giving the stablecoin certainty. Coinbase briefly contemplated applies to find the funds back in USDC, but retracted that proposal after heavy community backlash. The transparency over the provenance of its funds has been a big reason for USDC success. Unlike its rival USDC, which has found itself embroiled in repeated investigations, USDC has never been accused of any wrongdoing, and that has led to USDC gobbling up much of USDC's dominance in the stablecoin market. Although USDC commanded a 74%, 16% lead in market share in February 2021, and this has shrunk to a 45%, 30% lead in February 2022. USDC in the crypto market. USDC is currently selling at 0.999868 USD with a 24 hour trading volume of 6,932,531,160 USD. The current coin market cap ranking is number 5 out of thousands of crypto assets with a live market cap of 37,502,779,440 USD. It has a circulating supply of 37,507,743,326 USD coins. How is the USD coin network secured? All of the USDs in circulation are actually ERC20 token, which can be found on the Ethereum blockchain. One of the biggest advantages here is how it can then be integrated with Ethereum-based applications. As we mentioned earlier, security and confidence in this stablecoin is delivered by proving that US dollars are being held safely in reserve. Where can you buy USD coin? As you might expect, one of the most enthusiastic exchanges that offer USDC is Coinbase. Given how the exchange was involved in the stablecoin's creation, USD coin can also be purchased and traded on Polynex, Binance, OKEx, and Bitfinex, as well as decentralized exchanges such as Uniswap.
USDC is commonly bought with Bitcoin, the number one cryptocurrency. So with this, we've come to the end of the video for today. Kindly share with us your feedback concerning this video in the comment section. There are several educative videos on this channel for you to learn more about the financial market. Note that this video is not for financial advice but for educational purposes only. Kindly subscribe, share and like after watching. Thank you.